Okay, we're still making banana bread. We're making seven times the recipe. So we are going to mix the banana. This is bananas in there. We've got the baking the baking soda baking powder. That was uh, it called for two and a quarter teaspoons of baking powder per recipe. I ran out of baking powder, so I used half tartar and half soda. Because that's how you make baking powder. With some of it. to that. flour, but let's also add some cinnamon. Here's our cinnamon over here. Some cinnamon and how about some, what else have we got? Um, ginger, allspice, nutmeg. Here, we'll take nutmeg. We've got cinnamon and nutmeg. And some allspice. little containers. Now we have to add some flour. So we need how much flour? We need one and a half of a cup of sifted flour for each one of those recipes. One and a half cups of flour. Okay, so we'll get our this is one up to here. One is up to here, so if we heap it over, it'll be one and a half. Or we'll just, we'll do it the proper way, won't we? We'll turn it around again. Oh, your batter is low. So dip and then level.
dip level pour. So that's one, except the one was a little lower than that. Let's use a different container. I don't have another one. One and a half, so that's three quarters twice. Okay, so let's do three quarters twice every time. So that was one. Okay, so this is going to be half of what we need. Go ahead and mix that in. Well, that does not look like half as much as we need. That is pretty darn thick. That looks like all we need. But that could be because the bananas are frozen. Anyway, so now we'll cook them at, cook it at 350. So my oven is at 350. And I'll just, I'll just fill these containers up. I'll have to grease them all and fill them up and put them in the oven. And that will be banana bread. <laughs>